Meanwhile, partners at this year's Africa Social Impact Summit are speaking in unison on the need to achieve the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals ahead of 2030. At the summit, partners are concerned about how Nigeria is yet to achieve gender equality as girls are more than four times likely to suffer hunger, violence, unemployment and social injustice than boys. Various speakers, including the Speaker of the House of Representatives, who was ably represented by the Chairman, House Committee on CSOs and Development Matters, Victor Obuza, joined their voices to this call. The Africa Social Impact Summit has three main objectives. Number one is to build and scale partnerships. Number two is to attract increased impact investment into solutions on the continent. And finally, is to advocate for the right policies. This is why over 60% of out of school children in Nigeria are girls. The statistics is the same for food security, violence and abuse, and employment opportunities. These are not just numbers. These are people with names. How many do you know around your local community? Now, Vyad Berner, the German Consul General to Nigeria, is alarmed that the UN Sustainable Development Goal 2.0, which aims to end hunger and achieve food security by 2030, remains a major challenge. However, he is encouraged by the progress made in clean energy through public-private partnerships. Meanwhile, the Danish Consul shares her own perspective on these issues. We can really, I can say as a foreign observer, the new government under President Tinubu is trying more than the previous one to improve the energy sector. And together with German partners, it's a classical public-private partnership, we added together 670 megawatt to the Nigerian grid in the first half year of 2024. That's 15% more than before. We talk about how to write checks. Uh, we actually have pushed it to the top in Denmark in terms of understanding what is it really we have to do, what can we deliver into the equation of making the world a better and a safer place to be in. We understand that we cannot change it all ourselves. So we focus on the uh, climate issue, the green transition because, and the diversity inclusion and equality transition because we believe that these are core enablers to actually bring a social impact into the equation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.